in comes Tony Perkins, and Eaton backs away from him. Perkins now going after the great Togo. Back to Eaton, puts him down. There's one that puts the Japanese wrestler down. Oh, look at that. Bobby Eaton tried a drop kick on him, didn't do much good. Right into the knee of the great Togo. In his eyes, look at that. Now that is a very bad move. I, I would like to see that outlawed in all of wrestling. I think a possible injury to a man's eyes is, is just no place for it. Same thing right there, going for his eye. Bobby Eaton is taking uh, care of Ellis while the referee is occupied by the great Togo. Togo got the ref. He can't talk much English, but he got him tied up for a minute. Watch this. Oh, look out. Here comes Eaton. Gary Ellis slowly getting to his feet. Now, I saw that. Not Rocky Brewer either. Eaton looked over here and said, there's your Rocky Brewer. I said, no, that's not Rocky Brewer at all. Good, good young man, but not Rocky Brewer. Look at that. Both men working on him. Boy. Bobby Eaton who certainly knows what it's all about. I won't uh, hesitate to give him credit, even though he's on the wrong side of wrestling as far as I'm concerned. I won't hesitate to give him credit for his ability, and he has plenty of it. In fact, he has so much, it's a shame to see the young man waste it on Tojo Yamamoto and his type of wrestlers. When he has so much ability and could be such a, a fine young wrestler. Apparently money means more to him than anything else. Some people are like that. Ellis slowly getting up. He's up on the ring roll for starts up. Eaton reached across. He's got to give the man time to get in the ring. Goes right to work on Ellis. Ellis running back. Calls for Togo to come in. And Ellis is on the floor. Now both men, look at that. Both men, he's trying to go helping those. Well, it's actually, he's almost helpless. He's trying to get over and make the tag. You saw him reach out, but he couldn't get to Tony Perkins. Togo in between, cut him off. Will not let him move to his corner. Perkins waiting. But they don't want Ellis to get a tag out. They know that he has soaked up a lot of punishment. They're trying to wrap it up right here by getting him so run down that they can tag him, and they may just do it. It's good strategy, it's a good move. If they can keep him away from his corner. Uh-oh, did he get the tag? No, he did not. He was close enough that they simply missed each other. <coughs> a tough break. They were close enough to make the tag, but they just missed hitting each other's hands. I don't know how much longer he's gonna be able to hold off. Look at this, look at this, boy. Now Eaton is going to come in. Trying to wrap it up, and they may have it. One, two, three, that's it. Bobby Eaton, the winner, or whether getting a winning ball over Gary Ellis. Tony Perkins was stopped by the great Togo as he tried to come in and help, but there they are. Eaton and uh, Togo bowing to each other in true Japanese style. Nick Goulas telling him to get out of the ring and don't make any move toward getting after that young man. Well, wait, just wait. You'll get... Six or seven of what's going to happen to Rocky Brewer and his partner every time he gets to the ring with a Japanese connection. Okay. We'll take a little break here, fans, and be right back with you. 